What's up gamers? We're back with another WWE Immortals video and that's right today we're doing the Hunter Batista Nightmare Challenge mode. I've gone through all the stages right here and this is the very first time that I have done the Nightmare Challenge with the Knock gear. And I gotta tell you the Knight of Champions gear is so broken and so good. I've been using it all the time. But on this last level here of Challenge 5 with the Brock Lesnar where I'm going to get the Hunter Batista and do the actual Nightmare Hunter Batista boss battle, I won't be able to use the knock gear because I think third finishers are disabled. But before we do that, we're going to go and do the bronze and the silver, and I'll show you my teams. In the bronze mode, I use mostly Kane right here. And the reason why I use Kane is because he got a heavy attack glitch. And you can just swipe heavy attack indefinitely. And so the cards that I load up on him are basically just all of my top attack cards right here, which is my Chairman Soup or Baron Blade, which has, helps critical damage and critical attack, critical rate attack, and then Tribal War Paint, which affects critical damage. Huge buffs right there. So Kane is just going to run through it and do heavy swipes. In the second slot, I'm going to use Daniel Bryan. And the reason why I don't use Sheamus is because it creates some sort of like timing error with Kane. It doesn't seem to work right. And then the third slot where I'm going to do all my healing is with Paige. So with Paige, I'm going to do my healing card and my adrenaline grain card. And she has adrenaline drain on her first signature, so that's perfect. And with Daniel Bryan, because I am not using, I'm using attack cards on Kane, I'm going to use the Knight of Champion tickets on him so that he can pop third specials if I need to. So let's go into the final bronze battle, then we'll do the final silver battle and then that will get the hunter and then we'll also open up a gold pack and my goodness i'm the only person out there that has not oh finishers are disabled on this as well okay so I, it's a good thing i didn't put my really strong cards on kane there, the knight of champions so that's pretty awesome that can't use it but i am the only person out there right now that has not pulled an evolved seth rollins it seems like everybody's telling me i've pulled three out of 75k pack i do not have him yet so I'm going to open up a silver pack. The other thing that's going to happen at the end of this video is I'm going to get the three-star gear card for Batista, which I have not seen yet, and I'm looking forward to getting that. So here I've started the heavy swipe, you know, just constantly swiping on my screen from left to right with my thumb, just constantly, and they're caught. There's nothing that they can do. And I can just go through the whole battle like this, and it's kind of unfair, I understand. Let's see, I'm going to pop a second special on her right now. I actually have not seen Kane's second special in a long time. I think this is where they catch on fire. Yeah, they do catch on fire. Burning! <laughs> Alright, so block breaker. Oh, she's doing her dance. What a useless second special. Uh, what a waste. I mean, it's cool to see her dance and everything like that, but it doesn't do any damage or anything like that. Alright, so I she's in the corner now, so she's pretty much trapped, and this battle will be over, and we'll go into the silver battle. And right now, I'm going to get, what do I get here? Coins is a reward, 15,000 coins? Let's see. I think I get coins at this point, and the next one, I get a silver pack. Complete the challenge stage, and I get coins, 15,000 coins, thank you very much. My team is as follows. I'm going to use... The Rock in the first slot. And I think I'm going to put the Knight of Champions gear on him. Undertaker. And then Undertaker is my healer. And my middle slot, which is my main damage, is Seamus. So Seamus is going to do all the heavy lifting if I have to do damage to them. If I run into troubles. So I'm going to put the Celtic, Celtic Pendant. I don't know how to say that. With my Barbarian Blade and Tribal War Plant. And then on the Rock, I'm going to use the Chairman's Suit with the Knight of Champions and I should just be able to blow everybody away with third specials on this. That would be pretty awesome to see. Like I said, this card is really good. I hope they don't nerf it. Because it does take away a little bit from the game. Because you're not really doing anything. It doesn't require any skill. But anyhow. And then the Undertaker will be my healer. And I've got a DX Invasion truck. I don't think I'm going to have a problem. Let's do this right here. And after this, I will win a silver pack. And there's a bunch of silver cards I don't own, so that's always fun to get a silver pack. But this is primarily where I get all my silver cards uh, from these challenges. Okay, so this is tricky right here because we got the Voodoo Bay Riot, which the challenge is running right now. 
Um, I don't like to pop third specials on him until he's got like three quarters health or so, because I would hate to get stuck swapping health after I end a third special, and it just barely almost doesn't kill him. But that would be terrible if I had like just no health right here. Although I probably could make it up if that did happen. Boom! That's it. I think he's dead. Knockout. Oh, so we've got reduced adrenaline on this battle right here. So that's why my adrenaline didn't go to full three bars. And that happens in bonus battle seven as well. So you have to attack him a couple times to get it to go up. Okay, that should finish off the pirate Seth Rollins. I don't like pirates. I like ninjas much better than pirates, but I don't know. All right, and we got Steve Austin with his snakes. We got a gold one in here. One for the road. No, no, no. Oh, my goodness. He's throwing beer cans at me. What a redneck. What a weirdo with snakes on his arms. And a third special. I don't know if that'll be enough to kill him. If not, I'll bring in Seamus to finish him up. But I think that might. Let's see what we got. Boom! Victory! Okay, so right now I'm going to get a silver pack, which is pretty cool. Because I well, this is basically the only way that I get silver cards now. Is I don't normally open them. And here we are right here. What do we get? Silver pack opens, and we get a Solar Assassin, Nikki Bella. I don't know what I've got on her. I've got a bunch of hers, I think. I don't know if I'm getting close to... Well, she goes up to six. All right, I wish there was more use for silver cards in this game, but it doesn't really seem like there's a lot, actually. And now we're coming up the, against the boss battle. So we've got the boss battle, the Hunter Batista. He's got 138k health. I've got to take Brock Lesnar in here with me. And let's see what the restrictions are on this battle. We've got no finishers, Doom Clock, and Poison Cloud. Okay, so what I'm going to do is uh, edit team. I am going to use no, 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 Daniel Bryan for second specials. Let's just see how this goes. We're going to definitely do Cyborg Brock Lesnar. And in the last slot here, we're going to use... Uh, let's just use Big Show because he's Show. huge. Okay, we're going to do that. Lesner. We're going to make Brock Lesnar my main striker. We're going to give him Chairman Suit, Barbarian Blade, and Tribal War Paint. And what I'm going to do here on No, 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 Daniel Bryan is I'm going to put the Luchador's Mask on him so that he can do more damage. And I'm going to put the Knight of Champions gear on him just so that he gets adrenaline really quickly. And that'll be pretty cool. I think that actually might work out well. Because his second special does more damage than it says. It says 54,000, but I know it does more than that. I don't know if it's Big glitched Show. or whatever. And Big Show is going to be our healer. So we're going to put DX Evasion Truck, Battle Gear, and Battleground 2015 gear. Big and Show. let's do this! I'm actually pretty excited to get the third gear card. You know, the three-star gear card for Batista. I have not looked at it. I do not know if it's good or anything like that. But we're going to find out let's right now. Going. And uh, Brock Lesnar does not have good second specials. But I had to take Brock in here. I probably should have took the Conqueror Brock, but I only have that at two prestige, where my cyborg Brock Lesnar is at prestige five, and he has the the tap 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 no swipe of death. Ah, oh, okay. Let's bring in Daniel Bryan just to see how this uh, his second special goes. And it does so much damage; it's nuts. I gotta tell you. Boom, boom. Oh, don't hit me. No, no, no. Okay. So we're going to do second special right here. Boom, boom. And that probably will not kill him, but that'll be pretty... Wah! So much damage. Let's do some quick healing with uh, Big Show. My finger is hurt right now, so I can't get to 200%. Long story about that. But we're just going to call it the Sharp Cheddar Cheese Finger of Death incident. And I believe this battle is over. And... Booyah! We Drax went down like a clown. <laughs> Seems like I got Batista, Drax in every game I play, right? All right. Very cool. All right, we're going to go into my collection right here right now because I just was awarded my third Hunter Batista. Very cool. And we got Beast Fang. And we're going to take a look at that. I've not seen that. And then we will open up a 75K pack in hopes of getting, of course... And evolve Seth Rollins. Okay, so first things first. Where is my Batista? My Batista is way up here in the front. And I haven't had a chance to really to play him a lot. But I think he might be pretty good. I like that special ability right there. 200% increased damage to enemies when they have below 40% health. That just seems really good. 
And then let's take a look at this gear card right here. Beast Fang. 12% max health increase. And then Batista gets a chance to heal self on signature 2. And then Augmented is a 25% chance on last hit of combo. Uh, that will not be a card that I'm going to be developing at this time. Doesn't seem that great, actually. I mean, it's not a horrible card. It's not terrible. But it's just not something I'm going to really get into right now. All right. Oh, I do not have a 75k pack. I don't normally do this. But I'm going to open up a 100k pack just because I told everybody I would. And I don't have the 75k pack here on my screen. Well, 25k gone. What can I say? All right, let's open this. And I've got to say it. Big money, big money, no whammies. Give me something good. I do not want a duplicate of Big Show, Roman Reigns, Trish Stratus, or Necromancer. Anything else would be good. I would just lose it if I get an Evolve Seth Rollins. Let's do it. Big money, big money, no whammies. Stop. Awesome! Sweet! Ah, that makes my seventh. That means I get to fully max out my Daniel Bryan. That is awesome. He went from six to seven right here. And he has... Oh, man, I can't wait to play him. That is going to be so much fun. Look at that damage on his third special right there. 75k, that's nuts. And I know his second special does more damage than 60,000. It just it is really good. This card, I said at one time, was trash. And I think he's great now. Now I've got him Legendary 7. I'm very excited. Anyhow, and as always, thanks for watching and keep on gaming.